Hey streamy people, Draco Magnus here once again with Deluna13 for another episode of Let's Stream Kingdom Hearts 3D! In the last episode, we finished Prankster's Paradise by beating the same lobster, but like different color swap versions of it inside and outside of Monstro. That was wild. And in this episode, we're back in the Traverse Town area to help the World Ends With You crew, because they are apparently having difficulty with a Dream Eater that they need to kill for their Reaper game, whatever that is. Which, by the by, again, never played the World Ends With You, but this implies that the Reaper have found Reapers have found their way into this world to give them an assignment when they weren't technically here before. Because, like, don't they need assignments to do the game proper? Like, yeah. So yeah, so even though we don't see them, they have somehow found their way here so that they can properly give them assignments to do while they're in this world. Because I guess the world ends with you world is just gone. <laughs> Wild. Anyway, before we do that, though, we're going to do some flick, ter uh, flick cup or whatever it's called. <laughs> nope, that's the metal shop because we haven't done it, and I figured I might as well show it on screen a little bit. Flick Rush, that's what it was. Check in right here for Flick Rush. Koopo! You here to play, Koopo? I am... Am I ever! Alright. Let's do Tourney. Getting started with Flick Rush. Flick Rush has two modes, tournament where you battle your way past the computer, and wireless battle for taking on other players, if there was anyone still playing, but I don't know for sure how many people are actually playing this game still and doing Flick Tournament of all things, or Flick Rush Wireless. All right, tournament it is. We'll do the training top and finals, let's see. So our starting bout, Hey Mr. Rabbit, Bubba, and Than versus a Komori Bat, a Meow Wow, and a Heavy Rep. I got a good feeling about our team. Considering this is the first one. Final round, ready, start! Uh-oh. I would have a good feeling if I knew how to... Oh, right, you flick. That's the... Well... Alright, come on, Bubba. You got this. Ha-ha! Almost got this meow out dead to rights. It's time to do 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 Ah, damn, he got me. <laughs> he got you. I never. I was never good at this game, I'm not gonna lie. I, I did this once and I was like, yep, never fucking doing that again. Uh-oh, I'm all out of stuff. Uh-oh. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Get wrecked, Komori Bat. Going with the three, huh? Okay, that's another one down. Let's get rid of these weak ones to start. Wow, you really just attempted to do that, huh? Sleep. Ah, damn. I mean, so far I'm doing good, but this is the tutorial, so like... You know, I'm expecting to do good. There we go. 
You did good, Bubba. Bubba, Than, and Rabbit did excellent. Although, admittedly, I did sort of go wild with your cards at a certain point. We did it! You won the training cup. And got 90 medals for it. We took the gold prize! And our rush level increased to two. Whatever that means. We also unlocked the Flick Rush Beginner's Cup. We're probably not going to do every tournament, but I figured we'd get our feet wet and maybe do the Beginner's Cup. And then off screen, I'm probably going to do the rest of these and see how we do. Hmm. Okay, interesting, interesting. I choose you, Bubba! Alright, let's start with a, a light one. Okay, that's about what I was expecting. Damn. Damn. Okay, okay. Wild card! Damn. Alright, let's try to get a... I mean, I probably should have saved the Kiraga, but... I just realized you're, you're going up against Hainer. That, that bastard left Twilight Town for this. Oh my god. Shoot, I messed up. Damn. Okay, it's... Hainer! Fine. Heads! Oh, left! Oh, I can... I can combine cards, too. That's good to know. Oh, well, I guess I can't combine a bunch of cards. Alright, bub, we're gonna have to swap you out. But hey, just in time, apparently. Alright, I'm gonna have to let that one slide. Uh-oh. Okay, finally, one I can play against. Okay, so if it has enough build-up, I can do this. Get shrunk, loser. And it has to be the same attack for com combining, which makes sense, obviously. Okay, that's amazingly stupid. Uh-oh. What? Verizon is offering right now to get a free Nintendo Switch when you sign up for their home internet. <laughs> that is pretty dumb. I'm like, yes! I will totally take this internet to get this Switch. Not like they're going to have a, uh, a new console next year. Nah, not at all. Alright, let's duel. Oh, I could have taken that. I, I messed that up, but it's fine. Oh no, we're out. Actually, no, let's switch to Bubba. Uh-oh. Wait, really? Shit. Well, I'm really getting wrecked here in the Beginner's Cup, but it's fine. We still have two other attackers. Uh-oh. Ah, damn it. Got it. All right, let's get a cure out real quick, because Bubba's in desperate need of a heal. Uh-oh. And down goes Bubba. Okay, it's fine. I think that... Yeah, that did it. Whew, that was a tight one. It's okay, Bubba. You may have gone down, but you did good work. Okay, B. Not as good as the last one, but B for beginner. Oh, wait. There's more than one match. Hmm. 
I think we get full healed after each match. I hope. <laughs> if, if, if you don't, this is going to be very short. Yeah. Okay, yes, we do. Big fella. Oh, shit. Shit, okay. Alright, Meow, just to get ready to get your shit rocked. Oh, it didn't let me do the combo I wanted. Alright, down goes Meow just a. Let's swap. Ha! Putting the sheep to sleep. Oh, hey, it's Pence. Pence, what are you doing here? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hold on. There we go. Okay. Okay. Well, we're getting a little rough here. Oh shit, I didn't realize what he had. Okay, let's do... Yes! Perfect! Alright, now we just have to deal with the panda. Oh, never mind. Now we just have to deal with the panda. He's out of cards. All right, Bubba, you're up again. Shit. But well, speaking of Bubba, he's saying that I believe you can unlock special dream eaters by playing these cups. Oh yeah, there's the metal store, which uh, we can buy some stuff from there, different recipes and the like. Also, it's a trophy to get first place in all of them, so that's the goal. We did it! And no one fell this time. With an A rank. Okay, bronze prize, not the best, but you know, it works. Okay, so that was Big Hitter's Cup is two. I got Ba. Rainbow Cup is three. Now, when it says first prize in the tournament, does it mean I have to gold rank everyone or just get through everyone? Because if it's get through everyone, easy. If it's not, then we're going to have a bit of a problem and I might have to come back here when I'm overpowered. But we will see how that works. Let's see, we got like... About a hundred medals, I think. Uh, 240 medals. Ooh, there's some really fun looking commands in here. Deep Freeze, Balloon Deep freeze. Limit Storm? Riku only, though. Hmm. But I'm gonna need a lot of medals for any of those. So that's gonna be Lever. Drop Me Never? And then there's Drop Me Not. There's the Kuma Panda, the Thunderaff, the Pegaslick. Drill Psy? Hmm. I mean, I could buy the Drill Psy now, or the Kuma Panda, but I think I have a Kuma Panda already, that recipe? Sure, I'll buy Drill Psy. Why not? And then I'll maybe try to save up for Balloon Gun, Deep Freeze, and Sacrifice, and all that fun jazz. Like, both of those are Riku only. Interesting. Do, 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 do. Let's take a look at that really quick before we move on. Well, I know Meowjesty was one you get from the card, which I still haven't found my card. 
And I did actually look, but I couldn't find it. Alright, so recipe. We have Fin Fatale, Tatsu Steed, Doggy Rim, Escar Glow, the Peepsa Who, uh, Woe Flower, Juggle Pup, Cyber Yog. Ah, that's right, it was the Rhino. The Rhino was the Drill Psy. Hmm. You know, a thought just occurred yeah. to me. What? What's that? Probably should have asked everyone last uh, phase of our lives what they wanted their dream eaters to be, the people that we haven't gotten yet. That's true. Oh well. Okay, let's see. There you are. Ow. Uncalled for. Eat balloons. Okay. I forget where we were supposed to be going. We're supposed to, like, Jonathan had a mission for us. I don't remember where we were supposed to go to fill that mission. Yeah. Well, here's Link Portal. Achieve victory in 20 seconds or less. So I'm probably not going to get this, but let's see. Where is it? <laughs> Where is he? <laughs> Found him. Wait, it really? I mean, okay. It's literally that just... was, huh? That was so easy. It was just find the thing and kill it. <clears throat> I thought it was gonna be just like a lot of enemies, but no, it was just just the one dude. Die, ghost! That motherfucker just knocked me out of my attack! There we go. Wee. I think... Yeah, I think it's roughly this way. I if there's any other chests I missed. I mean, I'm pretty sure I got everything that was up here already in Sora's area. Wait, is that a chest over there? Well, shows what I know. <laughs> there we go. Oh, never mind. <sighs> Fucking mimic. You know, I just realized something kind of funny. What? You're used to pressing X, or not X, you're supposed to pressing A to open the chest. It's going to be weird for you to go back to 3. Yeah. I mean, we had that problem with, uh, not Dream Drop Distance, with, um, Birth by Sleep, too. Make I will say this. Namora. <laughs> I will say this, like, they were working with the, uh, with the limitations of the controller that they had it on the thing. True. Get wrecked, giraffe. Alright, where's the exit? Found it. I think we're going to Fountain Plaza? Yes, I was correct. Cutscene! The easiest way to- oh shit. This is starting to wear me down. Can we get a timeout? Oh right, it's this thing. I remember you. Summoning ass bastard. Miss me? Uh, Sora. I'll 
I'll take it from here. No. I don't need your help. <laughs> of course you do. Yes, you do. <laughs> You know what? At least he can see reason, Bubba. Hey, let me help you out. No, I'm fine. <laughs> Just... You're gonna die otherwise. Good point. You know what? Fair. <laughs> Time for balloons! One thing I'm gonna say, by the way, uh, Draco, mm -hmm. when you're grinding for the final world of this game, try to get as many balloon spells as possible. Hmm. I might try just my regular setup for a few times and then I'll acquiesce to that. Because I don't want to cheese if I don't have to. Because I'm pretty sure I've beaten him without just fucking up with the uh, balloon, but it takes forever. For fucking around with balloon. Those were the words I was trying to say. I mean, obviously I had at least some balloon, because how could you not run with balloon? But it is... Again, it's insane how broken they accidentally made this spell. And then the cowards never brought it back. <laughs> Alright, who's the one that turned off my commands? No, seriously, where, why can't I do commands? There we go, finally. Have access again. Oh, you the, that makes sense too. I mean, Neku can be a jerk sometimes, to be fair. <laughs> 90% of the time. <laughs> Obtaining Sliding Sidewinder. I'm assuming this is the dash attack that Riku has, but on Sora. He got away. Sora. Neku. So you must be Neku's partner. Yeah. I'm Shiki. Nice to meet you. Neku told me all about you. Cool. You should have seen him. He looked everywhere for you. <laughs> Stop oh, no, 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 don't, don't say that. You said you need her. That's a good thing. Don't give her a big head about it. <laughs> I'm trying to get laid with it by her. <laughs> I need you to stop annoying me. <laughs> Sorry, you have to understand. He's soon as fuck. <laughs> Sorry, you don't understand. This is a plot point in my game that I don't need you to really go more than that. <laughs> if you want to know more about my relationship, you're just going to have to play my game. You're what? Don't worry about it. Feels weird seeing him talk like that. Maybe it's you that's turning into Sora. <laughs> huh? Thanks. You're turning it. You're you're turning it into a, or into a true video game pro tag. What? Nothing. <laughs> I'm gonna heal. heal. There we go. There's another link portal. <laughs> Well, I'm going to have to kill those Dream Eaters if I want to even look at the portal. 
So the goal is the third district. Just a little too far to get all of them. Pop! Also, I realized I never properly, like, pet my dream eaters before stream. So I'll have to work twice as hard. Oh, wait, what is this one? Oh! Flow motion. Easy enough. Two. Three. I'm gonna fling this panda at some people. Well, panda at another panda. Again, just barely out of range. Got him. Finish. <coughs> you good? Oh, whoops. I accidentally cut off whatever I got. way to the third district? Maybe not. Uh, nope, well, that's the fourth district. I mean, that's close-ish to the third district. No, it's not. The first... The, the fourth district is, uh in the new area. You need to go to the original area for... Yeah, but I thought this connected to that. Or was it the Fountain District connects to the 3rd District? The Fountain District, right next... It's the, uh... The Telegraph thing. Oh, damn it. Oh, well, I guess I'm doing the Link Command again. Not intentionally. But, uh, here we go. Bubba getting big again. This feels like it's a bit of a waste, because, like, the enemies were almost all destroyed at that point. <laughs> oh, well. We still haven't seen what a rabbit's command is, I don't think. Okay, so let's see. Air slide, sliding, sidewinder. Y, then A. Oh, and I have another... another command. Okay, so what do we want to put in? Another offensive, another spell-based. Uh, what do we have in here? Time Storm could be fun. Sure, let's put in Time Storm. Try to level this out a bit more so I'm not just full magic. As much as I enjoy using spells. Just for a little diversity. Okay. So while we're doing this, I actually went back and watched the uh, Falcon and the Winter Soldier uh, the other day. Huh. That show is. That actually still is one of the ones that holds up for Marvel and all that. Hmm. Yeah, I never saw it. Personally, wait a minute. There was a spirit that we were trying to get, but I don't remember what it was. All I remember is that 
noble fancy was part of its ingredient list, I think. Or did we make that one? Hmm. Okay, and once again, I'm using Bubba's command, not intending to, but A. I feel like I use the link commands exceptionally frequently by accident. <laughs> I mean, I guess there's button presses that trigger them, but damn. There we go. Go through the fun post office. Um, I... Oh, no. Okay, good. I managed to save myself before falling all the way down. Okay, so it's not green. Um, I think it's the yellow one? Damn it, I couldn't get Time Storm out. Shit, shit! And now I'm at the bottom. Okay, now I think we're going the right way. Haha! Oops. Going up. There we go. <laughs> Leave it. All right, now from here, we can get to the third district. Oh, that's just more three meters. Time to stop, frog. There we go. Why can't I hit this fish? There we go. Alright, now there's just... Oh, wait, did we get it? I guess we did. Yep, let's go through that door and there it is. I thought there was like another dream you really missed, but I guess not. There was more. Oh, it can summon the last boss we fought here. Okay, good to know. Monka. We meet again, Hokey Monkey, I think your name was, or something like that. Have some balloons, punk! Shit. 
There we go. Where am I gonna launch you? Hmm. I'm gonna launch you at Lady and the Tramp. Uh, Rabbit needs the heal. And now this barrel's going right up your butt. Kaboom! <laughs> Storm. Well, that's him down. Hmm. Uh, oh, we're playing boss rush mode now. Okay. I bastard. Knocked me out of it. I think what I need to do is launch a barrel at that thing when it comes to summon more shit. I mean, yeah, this area arena is pretty good for doing slow motion attacks. I probably should do that. But I kind of like doing a mixed combo of things. And balloons in your crotch. Uh, and I'm dead. Okay, okay. Probably should have paid more attention to my health. I got Balloonra. Oh, he's got me locked in this corner. Come on, you're almost there. Yep. Just a little bit more. Oh, God. Okay, that was uncalled for. Oh, really? He got me in the middle of the attack? Lame. That was a well timed heal. Yeah. <coughs> Get back here. Got him. Okay, now. Nope, he is immune to attacks. Alright, have some more balloons. While he's on the ground, I can still get a bunch of hits from that. Oh, wait, hold on. Let's heal. We could use some more healing. Thank God for that leaf bracer. Oh, I almost got him. And that did. Alright, what now? I'm waiting. Yeah, that's about what I expected. 
Ha! I'm gonna make you fight every boss you fought so far! What do you think of that? I mean, that's three bosses, and admittedly one of them was super annoying, but... I mean, he can't walk on the ceiling anymore. Because there's no ceiling to walk on, you've kind of handicapped him. Oh no wait, Sora's one wasn't walking on the ceiling, that was Riku's. I honestly forget what this guy's gimmick was. I, th I think we were trying to avoid something, or like we needed to break out Monstro to fight him. Hey Onyx! Hello Onyx. I'm doing a boss rush. Doing okay. I mean, I did die once, but you know, happens. And dead. How many sessions do you think we got? Hmm. I mean, I said like four to six originally, but let me think. Because, like, you're still doing some god shopping. The... Hold on one sec. There we go. Uh, not again. Uh, what? <laughs> hey, Josh. Where'd it go? Somewhere else. Out of Travers. That's so... Okay. I was gonna say, that's so helpful, Joshua. Where'd it go? Somewhere. Mm. <laughs> so he failed the mission? I'll go after it. What? Come on. I'm not an actual player. Can't I bend the rules? <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess the rules of the world don't apply if your hearts are connected. Right, Sora? That's how you roll. This song kind of slaps. And it's settled. It, it does. <laughs> All right. While he's unlocking the key, I'll get back to my what I was saying. Um, let's see. You have like the god shopping shouldn't take too much longer. Only Ollie Sora. needs to get one. Thanks. Uh, the battle against the Miros is definitely not going to take too long. Yeah. The dive is going to be the one that's going to be a problem. Yeah. <sighs> let's see. If I had to give you an actual number. I think three to five is sessions is probably friend? accurate. You should come hang out in our town. Definitely. See you in Shibuya. Sure. It's a deal. You know, if my theory is right about Sora being in Shibuya, then this is hell of foreshadowing. Although, I think we already said that this was already disproven, my theory. I'll see him soon. Or someone in chat said that. I mean, he's in a Shibuya. Yeah. We just don't know if it's Shibuya Shibuya, or what is the view Shibuya? True. The Knockout Punch. A keyblade that lands fewer critical hits, but compensates with a strength boost and more frequent reality shifts. The game has not been paying attention to my uh, playstyle with these keyblades. You have. That's about as long as uh, we did for Shulta Personality, I believe, right? It was a year or like a year and change. About a year and change, yeah. Okay, so where do I... Oh, wait, I have to get Riku through now, I think. Although we have fewer episodes than Shelta Personality, and I think that's because, like, we had relatively consistent timing with, uh, episodes. Actually, this is the same magic, but with higher strength, so you know what? I will equip this to Sora. Like, with our sessions, sometimes they'll be, like, five hours. I try to keep consistent, but sometimes I get lost in the content. Unless someone lets me know, hey, it's getting a little late. But I try not to. Like, if someone lets me know beforehand, too, that uh, we need to end at a certain time, I will, of course, acquiesce to that. 
Oh, we are Actually, still. Here's a, there we go. Here's a uh, interesting thought. What do you think will be faster? You to end uh, end the session or us to end this? Hmm. I think... Let's see. We're like not even halfway through Dream Drop Distance. Hmm. I think this... Hmm. <laughs> That's a tough one. Uh, wait, what's this? Fully heal spirit the first time each runs out of HP. That is amazing. I will select that. Tech, magic, affinity, defense. Might as well get everything. Yeah. Hmm. I want to say that this might end sooner, but... I'm not even 100% on that, if I'm being honest. Ow. Oh, damn it, I got stunned. Because, like... Okay, that snapped the fish out of it. Like, they've still got a little bit, but they are definitely close to the end in Odyssey. They have to take a deep dive into the ocean. And battle horrifying sea monster at the bottom. And of course, anything that might have cost them along the way to the bottom of the sea. Which is anyone that knows anything about the ocean will tell you, is a lot. It is, yeah, that is a lot. And this is in a fantasy setting where horrifying things exist in the ocean, like dragon turtles can exist, or sea serpents, or giant fuck you sharks. And all sorts of other terrifying things. Yeah, I, I think that's probably the most accurate, Bubba, that Odyssey will finish first with no hiccups in scheduling being a thing. Like, you don't have the clowns to call in anymore if, it, if that, uh, it's wrong. Hmm? You don't have the clowns to call in if, if there is a scheduling hiccup. Yeah. I was thinking about maybe looking for other one-shots I could potentially run. I mean, like I said, when we ended with Send in the Clowns, it is possible for more clowns to happen, but I would just need the time to set apart to make my own thing to do in the Revelia. Like, set up a whole new narrative for a higher level cast. Wait a minute, is that another... I almost missed out on Portal. Alright, Titus, what do you have for me? Achieve victory without X commands. You drive a hard bargain, Titus, but I'll do my best. I did see, like, this Wild West setting on Roll20. They were, like, telling me about it in an email, and that might be something I look into. But as of right now, I don't really have any proper plans for anything as a one-shot. If you did a wild west setting, I would I would totally be a gun a gunslinger uh or so it's really guns gunslinger artificer. Mm. Now I need to just remember where on earth Riku was supposed to be heading, because I don't remember that either. Yeah, just keep going until you find a until you find a cutscene. It worked last time. God damn it! I keep accidentally skipping the rewards at the end. Okay. Why did I do that? Eh, fuck it, why not? Let's launch this fish into those fish. Oh, right. <laughs> He's doing the hopping fish thingy.
I hate blind so much. Well, I guess I accidentally activated my link commands again. Try it once, other times trying to escape from the King in Yellow's realm. I would say I'm most likely work like a story. I have no mouth and I must scream. That could be interesting. I mean, Here's a question be... for that. Hmm? Lucian is crazy. Learning the god, learning the King Yellow's true name. It's like, what would happen to an insane person if he got madness? I mean, I... hmm. I suppose that, like, in context of in-universe, mechanically, it would be another indefinite madness bestowed upon him. Woe, woe be upon ye. Where am I? There's an area where I haven't gotten a treasure chest from. Hmm. So I must be going the right way. So, like, I had a thought. My canonical for our universe, Hecna, end right now. He is basically going through... Well, first off, I will note again how everyone seemed to notice that Hecna was the only mask that was laughing after being trapped in the hell of being in the King in Yellow's court fully and totally. What that entails is Hecna is reliving his defeat over and over and over again, but it alters ever so slightly each time. Sometimes Watcher doesn't fall. Sometimes he almost gets all of you again, manages to take Red out, but then something else ends him. Sort of like the Diavolo from um, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Part 6, where he just keeps experiencing death after death after death. And then another idea occurred to me, like, what if a party were to somehow get dragged into the King in Yellow's universe and get trapped in the Revelia? Well, wait, the Revelia in the King in Yellow's universe? That'd yes. be fucking terrifying. Trapped going through both his and any other person that is sold to the King in Yellow's various different realities if they make it that far. Okay, this guy's getting on my last nerve. There we go. Okay, so I don't think it's the second district. It's probably not the third district, but we could check the third district. There we go! And of course, Hecna is laughing because he just can't help but find it hysterical. He got his wish! He gets to live in the Revelia forever. Just has to, you know, deal with that pesky reliving the same situation over and over and over again. But hey, at least he gets to live in the Revelia forever. <laughs> it's that thing of, yeah, I mean, I, I have to do this. But I also get to do this. <laughs> oh, wait, we're back at... That's where we came in. So... Fuck it, I guess let's go to the third district and see what's up over there. Wait a minute. Uh, another block one, I guess. Oh, yeah, Bubba, you didn't hear? Uh, we opened up the stream before we properly started with that. Akira Toriyama has unfortunately passed. Rest in peace. You know, I don't think I asked before. Was it, like, just natural causes, or...? Akira Tickerlitis. Uh... 
Oh wait, I forgot I'm supposed to be blocking things. Well, so much for that. Well, all right then. <laughs> I got I got distracted. <laughs> Completely forgot that blocking was something I was supposed to do. Oops. I did not mean to hit that, but okay. So like I said, I said this right before we actually officially started, but like everybody in this chat, everybody watching the VODs, we all technically have to thank Akira Toriyama for that. Because of the fact that if it wasn't for him, there wouldn't be Team Four Star, or there wasn't, or it wouldn't be Dragon Ball. If it wasn't Dragon Ball, there wouldn't be Team Four Star. If there wasn't Team Four Star, there wouldn't be the Unexpectables, and literally everything that came from that. Because, like me and me and Draco realized that, like we've met through the Unexpectables. Yeah. Oh, well. I'm going to have to put on a drop me not. Um, I guess we'll get rid of Fiara for now. There we go. Whew. No, I didn't mean to go to spirits. Oh, well, this is fine. Let's see how their ability links are doing since I'm in here. Yeah, there wouldn't be a Dragon Quest either. That Akira Toriyama, no Dragon Quest. No Dragon Ball. Um, I need to link with you more. Um, let's see, you have 87 Thero. So let's get that fire boost in. Hecna... Oh wait, we got all these already. All that's left for Hecna's chain is this stuff down here, so... Oh, thank god I need that blindness block so bad. Okay. I mean, I could pet and play games with them, but we're kind of a bit on a time crunch. I mean, not necessarily, but also kind of. Oh shoot, that's right, I wanted the command deck so I could edit my commands and get my Fiara back. There we go. Still no plot. Where is the plot? Still waiting on Broaden to get his link command so we can start linking with him. Okay. Hmm. Alright, as much as it's probably beneficial for us to battle things, I think I should just try and locate the plot before we move on. Or before we, uh get hopelessly lost. Okay, I'm getting sick of them. Okay, so... Back to the first district. Now let's go back to the back streets. They're back, alright. And yes, I did make that pun. In the year of our Lord, 2024. All right. <laughs> when was the last time any of you had thought about the Backstreet Boys? Probably decades. <laughs> For me, it was only a couple days ago because I have I have that song on my playlist on my YouTube. Well, never mind then. <laughs> 
Like, I hear that song every other day. So you Not were every day, about but every other day, whenever I'm like, I want to listen to my music. So you're thinking about them significantly more frequently than the layman, that's for sure. Like, there was a, uh, there was a, a post on, on the, uh, front of my shirt, like, can you, can you summon an entire generation with a song? And I'm like, yeah, it's called Everybody, or Backstreet's Back. Yeah. <laughs> that will, that is basically like the, that is the millennial anthem, whether we like it or not. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. I feel like uh, another potential candidate is uh, somebody once told me the word. That one too. <laughs> that one very much too. All Star is most definitely the millennial anthem. Especially when accompanied with the millennial movie of Shrek. Oh, um, Bubba wonders if Toriyama's death will affect his new series Sandlands manga that, and it's game yeah, they've already out. Hmm. they've already said that there is a uh, there's a lot of things that he was working on that will or that will probably have to be put on ice. Yeah, that's unfortunate. But well, what can you do? Okay, so now we're back in the Fountain Plaza area, so... Something from here has to be the way we're supposed to be going. Oh wait, we got them all. I think I'm gonna need another drop me not soon. Which really sucks considering Sora doesn't have anything to do until Riku finishes. Oh, thank god. Okay. <laughs> Hello, wizard pelican. I mean, yes, I'm having a great time. You two are cut from the same cloth. <laughs> I ain't made of cloth. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, the stream here is just sitting here like, um, like I'm still here? Hello? Yeah. He's come through for me, so I know what you mean. There. See? I'm a rhyme. You didn't just call me a punk again. Huh? <laughs> 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 huh? No, that's fine. You're not important. Go away. All right, now we ruffle its feathers. Ready to do this? Yeah. Me and Ryan will handle things here. You go after that thing. Right. We'll do. Look, Bird. It's not that we don't care about you. It's just you're not important at the moment. But we don't care about you, and the fact that we kn I know for a fact this is not the last time we're going to fight you. Well, it seems I've done the blade charge again, by accident. I'd love to do just Broaden's reaction command, but I keep accidentally procking it somehow. Uh, 
if you hold left and right at the same time, that's what triggers it. So now I know what's happening. I'm turning the camera with left, and then I'm hitting the lock on button at the same time on something, and that's what's causing me to accidentally use my link commands. Actually, no, I think you need to hit both buttons to link command anyway. So then what's happening here is I'm locking on, trying to do a command, and doing the link command. Okay, now I understand the problem. Maybe I can work around it. <laughs> so now we have to go back to the third district, I guess. Oh, nope, here we go. Wait, really? They released another Dragon Quest anime? Damn, I wish I had Netflix to see it. <laughs> I never saw the original one, even when I had Netflix. Triceratops. My favorite dinosaur as a kid. I love the but. shield lizard. Triceratops, also my favorite ranger. That's the blue ranger. Oh uh, yeah. T-Rex is also a high contender, but I feel like T-Rex was everyone's favorite as a little kid. It was mine, and I'm not afraid to admit it because of the fact that when I was young, I got to see the uh, T-Rex named Sue, which is the largest the largest uh, complete skeleton of a T-Rex that was ever found. Oh, neat. That was so fucking cool, because, like, the, the, from head to tail, the, the skeleton was 45 feet long. Wow. Or, not, or, not, or 30 feet long, sorry. Still impressive. But they're like, yeah, like, this T-Rex would have weighed at least, at least 45 tons. That's where I got that number from. Dragon Quest The Adventures of Die. It's 50 episodes, damn. That's a proper series. Yes, we can create the Sarah Terror. Riku, the third district. We're going to pin it between both worlds. Got it. <laughs> All right, back to the third district now. What was the name of the first Dragon Quest series on Netflix? I should save these names so I could look into them later. And I don't know why, but that just suddenly reminded me that I still need to look at that song you sent me. Bubba. I was say, which one? I didn't- I don't know if I sent you anything. Nah, you didn't send me anything. Bubba sent me a song for potential use in the Curse of Strahd campaign. I think I put it on in the back, or like, I put the link in the background while I was streaming so I would check it later. But then it made it difficult for the raid, so I had to get rid of it and I forgot to reopen it again. But I still should have it in whispers, so I should definitely be able to grab it. And let's just clean out all this new nonsense. And... Nope, not spirits. I wanted the command deck. Well, while I'm here, might as well not waste time. I keep doing this mistake. The fun fact of the day that was just randomly tweeted out. The Statue of Liberty wears a size 879 shoe. Huh. That is random. And I suppose a fact. That is a... It... <laughs> Thank you, Ripley's Believe It or Not Twitter account. I have no idea why the hell you ended up on my Twitter, but 
that's a thing now. Shoot. Here we go, got that. There we go. I'm genuinely surprised that didn't hit the... There we go, that's one. Okay, 2-2-2 two, two, two isn't too terrible. Eh, while I'm here. Oh, wait. They changed to launcher, but the de does that get rid of the secret that he already had in his ability link? Did I miss out on getting... No, I didn't, thank god. Okay. I was a little concerned about that. Okay, so I could get more defense. I could get magic. What's over here? Blizzard screen, blizzard screen, blizzard screen. I get another circle rate if I go down this way, but defense wouldn't be a miss. I could wait till I link with him one more time so I can get the reload boost and unlock the secret here. I think I'm going to save for that. I might regret that decision, but I'm going to make it. Okay, what about you, Thero? Let's see, you have 115. We're going down the chain, getting you this fire screen. And I'll have to wait to get the fire boost. But we're going along his chain. I can get the attack haste for Hecna. And finish off Hecna with the Thunder Screen. That is... Oh, wait. I forgot about this up here. There's one more thing to get for Hecna. The Collision Magnet. Which I already have, but I guess I could take it for, like, fusion, I suppose. Man, we just gunned through Hecna's stuff, I feel. And these are B tier. Hmm. But we're gonna have to put someone in here to replace. Eventually. Sarah Terror is an E. Wait a minute. Alright, that's Intrepid Fancy. That one's for the Cyber Yog, which is an F tier, which I don't want. Ooh, Stagger Seps is an E, so meh. Cyber Seps D. Okay. I'm gonna find it again. An A rank me, me, me if I use Fleeting Fancy and Lofty Fantasies. Okay, so I need more Fleeting Fancy, but that's probably what I'm going to want to do if I'm making Alu. Because A rank is too good to pass up. So someone could write that down for me. Fleeting Fancy and Lofty Fantasy. I need two more Fleeting Fancies and then we can make it. Um, we also have Thunder Wrath in F and E. Drill Psy C with the Noble Fantasy. Oh, and with Grim Fantasy, I can make a D Sarah Terror. Okay. Where was the thing I was trying to make before? Oh, hey, I can make the Ice Gwyn. Eh. I mean, it's only an Penguin. That's what it was. So, Lofty Figment, Noble Fancy to make Sir Crew. Okay. I'll make a D Sir Crew right now. Uh, he's a bit of an attacker, I believe. Oh, let's see. Uh, they've got swords and sorcery down, but a douse of fire will melt their courage. Okay. So a collision magnet wouldn't necessarily be a bad thing for him. It's plus attack and some magic. So yeah, let's do that. Who am I going to name after Sir Crew? Hmm. Or name Sir Crew after. With his weird pickle sword. Hmm. You know, 
I know we're going for names of uh, friends, but I think out of uh, out of respect for the fact that again, this is basically just Frog from from uh, Chrono Trigger. Uh, Chrono Trigger was heavily made by the Kiritoriyama. Toriyama. Be a, like Akira would be a good name for him. I like that. In homage. A K I R A. Right. Right. Here is Noble Akira. Uh, and let me double check. Fleeting Fancy. And. Was it Intrepid Fantasy? Uh, no. Alright, we're gonna have to go through again. Um. Ah, Lofty Fantasy. It is three fleeting fancies and two lofty fantasies. I already have two lofty fantasies. I would just need the two more fancies. And then we can make Alu. So who gets Akira? I love how Broden shoots fireworks when he's happy. Do I replace Heck? Well, I mean, I have one more thing I gotta get for Hecna. So obviously we'll keep him in for at least getting another collision magnet. I should probably work on the others too, but... I mean, Broden's getting a lot of stat points right now. Work on him, like, for another day. Also... It's still really cool that we got that brought in the uh, freaking stag beetle. Yep. Yeah, okay. Broaden's officially done, unless I want to go around his body for petting. So now let's work on Thero a little bit again. If I'm going to be in here, I might as well put in the work, you know? Very hey, fair. Hey, Thero's a salamander. Okay, Thero's done. And let me check Thero real quick. Oh! Yep, got a new route out of him. Okay. Let's see, do I want to get Fiara? I could get the fire... Well, I have to get the fire boost to get to the Fiara, but that takes 100. We are close to that. Fire Windmill. But I could get the HP boost. Yeah, let's get the HP boost now to open up to the... Magic haste. And uh, then we'll just hold off on this other stuff. Kidok, let's see. Okay, we're still getting points out of Thero. points out. Okay, now he's getting one point and stuff, so now we'll go to Hecna. I mean, for all I know, Hecna will get more stuff if we get him to a new rank. That's true, but you weren't crazy. Just by petting him alone, I got Hecna at a level 24. Although he's probably close anyway, so it's not a huge... Oh, hey, he just shifted to a flake. Damn, he's getting lots of points. And then I'll look at his tree to see if anything new has developed. Okay. 
And now... Anything new pop up for Hecna? No. Not this time. Okay. Now that we've done that, the actual reason I came into my menu is to get a drop me knot. Oh, perfect. Then we'll actually find a thing to put in there after I put the drop me knot in. There we go. Uh, this is a bit of an awkward angle to have this. Yet I still managed to hit something. Like it was slightly off of where I wanted it, but I'm not gonna question it too much. There we go. Hey, it's Geppetto's house. Where he not in a whale right now? Wait, wait, that was like okay. Th is he there? Nah, he's if he's not there, that raises more questions. I mean, you know, he's in. Uh... Well, he's not in Monster anymore, is he? At this point. <laughs> No, he's not. Be so, oh, if that's a mimic. Well, I mean, it probably is, because I would have gotten that chest otherwise. You don't know that. No, I do. Uh, no, you don't. Oh. Really? How did I miss that? I'm genuinely surprised that was one I missed. Okay, get Fishbone and Tatsu Blaze. Why not? I've got the money for it. Alright, let's see. What was it? No, Fleeting Figment, Lofty Figment, Rampant Fancy, Intrepid Figment, Noble Fancy. Dang it, why can't you have the you things I need? You might have gotten that need? chest of Sora, Bubba says, which makes sense. Yeah, I could see that. Let me just get rid of this new cell nonsense. There we go. And we just got those. So that should be it. Uh, new abilities. We got water boost, cure boost. Alright. Should I keep the drop me knots in for now? I mean, we're close to the end of this with Riku. I might as well just change it out for something. Time bomb. Turn nearby foes into em picking time bombs. When they go off, they will damage surrounding enemies. I mean, that's good if I'm not fighting a boss, but it's kind of worthless when fighting a boss. What else I got here? Gravity Strike, Confusing Strike, Circle Raid. Circle Raid is fun. I also like Gravity Strike. Sure, let's put Gravity Strike in and do that. 
Actually, no, we'll put it at the end, because Time Storm is a ground-based move. Yeah, no, that makes sense to me. I mean, it makes sense to keep Drop Me Knots on you, but at the same time, I'm like, I don't really use them unless I have to finish a world as somebody. Let's see what Rodney does on his own. Okay, it's a fire-based move. Interesting. Wait, isn't Theros also fire? Huh. Oh wait, by doing that I lost my oh well, too little too late. <laughs> I got you now! This is my street, yo! You gotta play by the rules. Oh no! Hey! Dick? Sorry. I don't to play by anything! Bye! This is so tired, yo. Every time we chase him down. I know. Oh, bother your best friend! Other side. Don't worry. Yeah, well, I still don't like it. I mean, that's fair. You know, you are such a good listener, B. <laughs> You're like a sponge, really. Me? I'm not a sponge. I'm just me. <laughs> you mean Daisuke no Jo Beto. Hey! Don't use my full name! That's a weird name. That's hey. quite a mouthful. <laughs> no wonder he goes by beat. <laughs> you know what? After everything that Rika's been through, it's just nice to see him laugh. Honestly, yeah. Well, it's time to go. Hey, Riku. Thanks. Yeah. Stay cool. We'll catch up with you soon. Mm -hmm. Say hi to Sora. Sure. Riku, In... remember what I said. You know, I don't think he said hi to Sora after this. If this really is a dream, it's going to lie to you. To try and make you think it's real. I got it. What? I don't got it. <laughs> you and Sora would break your heads on this one. Accurate. <laughs> I think we can all agree that that is correct. And knockout punch again. Just cast faith. All right, Malefcent. Tell us what you want. Let me see. Shall I begin with this world? I much preferred it in its darker, more ominous permutation. You said it. This place needs some lights out time. You're lying, Malefcent. Not even you would go through this much trouble just for that. What is it you're really after? Hmm. Very perceptive. I presume you are familiar with Xehanort. Who isn't? The man who led me to discover worlds outside of my own. You know him? As uh. you, I see. Yes, he shared everything with me. How to go about winning a heart over to the darkness. And most gloriously about the seven hearts of pure light the ones that would grant me the power i need to conquer all worlds however the worlds were too complex 
too much for even me to eat. It seemed I had miscalculated. Then it came to me. Of course, I could go about conquering other worlds in my own manner. You do have the data for all of the worlds, do you not? <laughs> and now you yeah. I love how little they referenced that. What? It was referenced as important as it was to the actual plot. No hey, remember that time we went to the Datascape? That was wild. <laughs> uh, 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 want a royal mini mouse in us to get a boo boo now, would we? I see you have failed to recognize the futility of your situation. But also, hey, if you want to see us play through Recoded, that's on my YouTube channel. And it happened pretty recently. Why couldn't we ever play as this trio? <laughs> that would have been interesting. That would have been so cool. Because Vicky can literally do what both of these two can do and do it better. Yeah. I mean, Mickey's basically Sora, but stronger. Hey, wait for me, Maleficent. Wait. You used the darkness to get here? That was reckless. But gosh. I didn't expect you to save us. Axel. Axel didn't. My name is Lee. Got it memorized. Oh, he said the thing! Oh! Shit. I remembered I had I that did, I didn't have it ready. Me. I didn't have it ready. I'm sorry. Oh, oh well. I forgot he was going to do that this game. No worries. Like, I had one job and I failed. <laughs> it's okay. Hey, oh, let's let's oh. view this. Remember recoded? That was a thing that happened, anyways. <laughs> you know, Bubba has a good point. Mickey is more experienced in the ways of light. Okay, now we finally unlocked the next two worlds. So I guess we're gonna start as Riku. Oh wait, is there only three worlds left? Yep. Huh. Well, I guess we're gonna start with the country of the Musketeers. Well, these worlds are actually, like these. I'm not gonna lie; these are my two favorite worlds in this game. Yeah. Either one is fine to start with, because this is actually one of, I think, the most underrated Disney movies of all time. I love how for the dive we have a bunch of comic book pages. Yeah. Oh, I should have just hit that. That's all me. Shit. Alright, that's one down. Broke your weird head, dealies. Oh. Okay, phase two, let's go. Alright, open up. <laughs> Yeah. 
Oh, shit. Oh, went too far past. Alright, alright, we're almost... almost there. So now you're doing that. Okay, it feels weird that that missed. Trying to get my ass beat. <laughs> oh. Damn. Avoid the super labor, take cover behind the rocks. Okay. That's where I was messing up. I was just trying to dash past it when I should have been taking cover. Nice juke. All right, come on. Okay. Apparently, I didn't take cover well enough. Oh, shit. I don't think I'm going to be able to make it through this time. Or I'm going to get, like, the worst score so far. Nope, still not- yep, nope, wasn't gonna make it. I mean, I don't want to get hit by the rock. Damn. No, I think I think if he punched you, that would hurt. Just occurred to me I'm still in full screen. Although you're not missing much on the bottom screen at this point, you're just missing that I can do this. One down. So somehow I need to figure out how I stay behind the rocks without actually hitting them. for the laser. Oh, I guess I won't hit the rock if I just stay right here. I was worried about getting hit by the rock, because, like, I'm falling. I didn't expect it to be consistently the same speed, <laughs> where we won't ever hit it. Which I feel like is a fair assessment. <laughs> Or like a fair thinking process where I don't want to hit the rock. Oh, wait, really? Only the one? Okay, only one left. Now he's going to start flipping out. Alright, now for the tentacles. Ah, 
Damn, he got me with that last one. Hey, X. Oh, shoot, got hit by it ever so slightly. I'm beating a squid. All right, here comes the ring. Gold Diver. Did better than I thought I did. Zero Gravica. Ooh. The maximum gravity. Egg, leg, Pete. Well, Riker, you ended up in... Country of the Musketeers! Well, one thing's for sure. That guy adds up to trouble in any world. Yeah. Oh, hold on. Reality Shift. Wonder Cosmic. Trap enemies in a comic book world where their ending will not be a happy one. Use the touch screen and follow the directions correctly to blast all nearby foes. Or wonder comic, not cosmic. <laughs> right, now I just have to get Sora over here as well. So I guess we'll play for Riku for a little bit. Until he drops, get Sora up in here, and that's probably where we're going to end the session for the night. That oh. works. We still have 1.6 time left, so. Yeah. So there was a better lion I could have given to Than I'm seeing. I just so went with the first lion, but I mean, I could technically name another character after him. Oh wait, hold on, hold on. Let's do some comic book action. Peg leg Pierre, that's right. Ah uh, yes. Because they're in, they're in Le France. We. Oui. I just realized that means there's two worlds in this game that are in France canonically. Notre one's Dame in old and France here. and one's in older France. <laughs> yeah. Like, I'm not exactly sure off the top of my head the century divide, but it's somewhere like 18th and 15th, I think. Pop! <laughs> More comic nonsense. Swish. The comic book reality shift is another one of my favorites. That's also true. But if I happen to make an one of them, I should probably name it after Than too. Maybe Than Jr., Than the Second. <laughs> or just name it after Andro straight up. That's also a possibility. Benoy! Get him! trying to block me. How dare! Balloon! Uh, balloons, damn it. Pop! Get over here. Keep going! Oh, I accidentally went the wrong way with that. No! I love, I love this, this, uh... 
the shot lock or whatever. What was it, Link or something like that? Uh, the reality shift. Yeah, reality shift. I I love this. Like, you're a comic. You're you've jumped into the comics. There we go. Finally got the Kira. Oh no, I got stopped. Damn, this line's kind of a pain in the ass. Alright, got the heal out. Get my treasure. Alright, now I think I've gotten everything in this opening area except for that link portal I'm now seeing. Uh, achieve victory in less than 20, uh, 20 seconds or less, rather. Oh my god, it's adorable. It's tragic that I have to kill it. It's adorable. It must die. Damn, the challenge has failed. And there's like exactly one left, isn't there? Yep. Oh well. I forgot the Drakis were a thing. Finish. Alright, let's head into the castle proper. With nine seconds to spare. God damn it. Alright, what do you have that's new? Aerial slam. Knock a foe into the air, then slash it again as you rock it downward. Launch even more foes with the resulting shockwave. Um, that could be interesting. I'll grab that. Sparkra. Definitely have to grab that for Sora. Which eats up the remainder of my money. Press A right after a successful block. Yeah, I don't care about that. Although, it is a Riku exclusive thing. Maybe I should care. Oh, hey, the Mimi Me Bunny recipe. Hmm. Okay. Well, I wasted all my money with that, but worth it. <laughs> so instead of Gravity Strike, we'll put in Aerial Slam, just so we have a new thing in there. And then go to Command Deck for Sora. And it's time to put in Sparkra. Perfect. Leaving Sora with a nice gift. Wait, I still have a c command? What did I get? A new command. Sonic Impact? Press Y while air sliding to perform a charging attack. Oh, when did I get that? Hmm. You yeah, might as well put that on Sora as well. Oh wait, so that just did it for both of them. Cool, cool, cool. Three, two, one. Midair drop. That's what I thought it might be. Alright. So let's see. We'll do a drop decelerator, of course, as is tradition. Magnet spiral, sure, why not? Um, I'll do attack, magic, defense, affinity, and there. I'll get everything on the list, because no one can stop me. World map! <laughs> Whoop!
Hmm, good to know. Oh yeah, I forgot to switch Riku's Keyblade all that time, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh well. Nothing I can do about that now. I missed the thing. Oh well, it's fine. No! Ah. Damn, I couldn't get both. So I'm not doing great on this dive. Although I am collecting the big things, so there is that. <laughs> Okay. Nope, couldn't get the boom, but I can get that one. Finish! Yeah, that's what I was expecting, honestly. I kind of flubbed that a few times. Remember. <laughs> is this like what happened with Jiminy and Tron? <laughs> but I'm not in Disney Castle. And that world isn't one of the ones that's asleep. I don't get it. You okay? What's wrong? Oh, um, I was wondering where I was. Mm -hmm. Where'd you get that key? This? It's a key. Bl Shh. I know what this is. Very. I'm Sora. Let me handle it. <laughs> All right. Take out the dream eaters. I absolutely love the fact that he's like, look, I know who you are. I know what you're, what you, what you are, but please don't ruin this for me. I really want to do this. <laughs> look, I I'm also from another world. Come on, chill out a little bit. You should know Have the rules. The <laughs> Have you seen the princess? She's really hot. I really want to get with her. <laughs> I do like the implication. That's why he's here. <laughs> Not like anything with training or anything like that. No, no. Really pretty, the princess here, and I want to date her. <laughs> Maybe marry her. <laughs> okay. 
King's Park is cool. That's right, robot. We've made it to Musketeer Land. And now it's time for Bubba to once again grow big. Uh-oh. 3DS dying. Okay, we're plugged in. We're all set. Thanks. I sure owe you one. Some musketeer I turned out to be. Hey, hey, whoa, ow, whoa. Where's the bad guys? Goofy. Everything's under control, Goof. Really? You mean we clobbered them? Sure. Yes, but also no. <laughs> no. Nice to meet you. Say, fellas, this is Sora. And it doesn't matter when we met, once we make a friend, we're friends for life. This is true. <laughs> and I'm goofy. Mm. Friends for life. Now, we've got to go protect the princess. <laughs> Bubba brings up a very good point. Mickey just wanted to live out his version of the Princess Bride story. Hey, wait. You're not gonna let me come along? But you're not a musketeer, and this mission is fraught with danger. I have a keyblade. When the going gets tough, the tough call their friends. Hmm. Alright, thank you. Great. Should we do the thing? Listen, do you have a spare, like, hat and smock or whatever that is? And one for all! And welcome once again to the country of musketeers! And now... Let's watch a flashback. Congratulations, boys! <laughs> In light of your lacklustrous potential, I dub you Royal Musketeers. Just look at you, all dressed up and going nowhere. And <laughs> going nowhere. Fuck you, Pierre. Now then, let's get right down to your inaugurary mission. Bodyguards 2. Princess Mini. Some nefarious nincompoop has got it out for her, see? So who's the king in this scenario? Somebody's after the princess. Do we ever you see know, they her? Never, they never say, but if it's like the old stories, like Mickey, or Minnie does have a dad. Like in the old old versions of like the stuff, they just never mention them anymore. I don't know, this Pierre guy seems like he's setting him up for failure. But why would he do such a thing? Are there any treasures in here before I uh, move on? Well, you're about to, you were about to end it, right? Well, yes, but I figured I'd look around to see if there's anything I can pick up in this building before we end. Okay, there's a mega potion. A dream ice cream. Okay, nothing over there. Whee! Nothing over there. 
Okay, I think we got all the treasure that's in this area, unless... There's some up here. Doesn't seem like it. Okay. There we go. Now. You don't have anything new, right? No, it's just I have new shit to sell. Do, 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 do. The magnet spiral I just got. Alright, we'll save one more time. Okay. And with that, I think we'll end this episode here. Delona, would you like to tell these lovely people where you are, what you can do, wh or what you do, and where you can be found? <laughs> what I can do is I can tell you that we're going to be, that it's going to be the next few weeks of me sharing that, that Sadako meme, like I said earlier. Yes. But you can find me on Twitter at Delona1338, which is where I'm going to be sharing that. Find me on Twitch, YouTube, and Blue Sky at Delona13. It's looking like, I have not been told otherwise, that we are going to have a Power Rangers Cyber Strike on Saturday. So keep an eye out on Twitch the Person's YouTube channel for, or uh, Twitch channel for that. Or or definitely keep an eye out for my post on the tw on Twitter. Tuesday, I'm assuming that we're going to be over here. It's going to probably be a game night. Mm -hmm. Since our, like if you haven't seen seen a uh, phase of our lives that is a bi-weekly show because uh, scheduling conflicts on a bunch of other people so it's better that way then again Thursday here I'm not doing that much because I'm in school but next week is spring break so yay woo Spring break! I actually get to experience spring break and summer vacation again, Draco. I'm so happy. Hmm. I never really did uh, sp going off to spring break. It's just not a thing I ever did. Okay, up oh, and uh, of course. You've already found me here. I stream Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Fridays. On Monday, we're going to be playing more Cross Code. I'm going to be looking around the world for different items I need to boost the enemies, to make them more of a threat, so I can get the materials, to get the cool new equipment, and also doing, you know, side quests I find, looking for treasure that I missed, all that fun stuff. And maybe we'll even continue the plot Maybe, if we can get around to it. Perhaps. Uh, Tuesday, like Duna said, we're probably going to be here for party games. But next week, Tuesday, or the week after next week, rather, you can catch us over at Burnout Vaughn's channel for Phase of Our Lives. We've just gotten to the Witch Lake Carnival over there. And all sorts of wacky shenanigans are going on. Who will be the Witch Lake Monarch? We'll just have to see. Wednesday, you can catch me here for more Triforce Heroes, where we are about to tackle on the last world of the game. Or region would be more accurate. Region of the Drablands, Sky Realm. What will we encounter in the skies? You'll have to tune in to find out. Thursday, more Dream Drop Distance, where we're in the last three worlds. Well, we're in one of the last three worlds. Let's see where Mickey will take us. And last, but certainly not least, every Friday, you can catch myself, Royal Hoshi, Lost Knights, Yelling <coughs> at Me, Broad and Rod, Onyx Locket, who was here not too long ago, as they go through Odyssey, a Rhapsody of Fire. Immortal Samachia are in the realm of the City of the Lost Sirens, deep in the bottom of the ocean. Well, not quite at the bottom of the ocean yet, but that's where they're going to be heading. So they're shopping around for some lost gods and the benefits they can give them before they head down to fight Cilia, the most powerful monster of monsters, deep at the bottom of the ocean. Will they be able to get down to her and deal with this most powerful of monsters? You'll have to tune in to find out. But with all that said and done, 
and me just sifting through all the new stuff. How about we go find someone to raid? Let's see, there's a lot of people that are live. Huh. Rabbit is playing the original Alan Wake. 